For centuries, humanity has believed one truth about the cosmos, that nothing in it ever truly stands still. Every planet spins, every star burns, and every comet races endlessly through the void. But a few months ago, that certainty shattered. The James Webb Space Telescope and observatories across the world detected something that should be impossible. Thrikai, Atlas, an interstellar traveler older than our sun itself, suddenly stopped moving. Not slowed, not dimmed, stopped. It was as if the laws of motion, the very heartbeat of the universe, had skipped a beat. Instruments confirmed it wasn't an error. Multiple telescopes across continents and in orbit all saw the same impossible image. An object frozen in place against the backdrop of the stars for hours, maybe days. And when 3i Atlas finally began to move again, the questions it left behind would shake physics, astronomy, and even philosophy to their core. Was it a simple cosmic illusion, or proof that there are forces or technologies beyond anything we've ever known? Because this wasn't just another comet. The James Webb Telescope captured thermal oscillations, rhythmic shifts in temperature, and patterns of light that looked less like chaos and more like control. Something or someone seemed to be regulating this object. So, what really happened when the universe went silent? What could make a massive interstellar body defy gravity, inertia and time itself? As scientists are now discovering, this wasn't just a pause in motion, it was a message. It began like any other night of observation. Quiet, routine and predictable. Across observatories from Chile to Hawaii, astronomers were tracking the faint shimmer of 3i Atlas, an object known to be on a hyperbolic trajectory cutting through our solar system, a cosmic passerby never meant to return. But then the unthinkable happened. At first, the instruments showed a strange flattening in its velocity curve. The object's measurable motion across the sky, its proper motion, began to decline. Within hours it reached zero. Thriki Atlas, an interstellar body traveling at tens of thousands of kilometers per hour stopped. The disbelief was instant. The laws of physics leave no room for rest in space. An object in motion must stay in motion unless acted upon by a force. Yet no gravitational field, no visible jet, no nearby planet or magnetic influence could explain this event. It was as if the very fabric of space around it had conspired to hold it still. Technicians first suspected a calibration error Perhaps the telescope's tracking software had glitched, or a background star had aligned perfectly to mask the movement. But within minutes, confirmation came from other observatories in Japan, Spain and Australia. Even amateur astronomers using high-sensitivity telescopes reported the same anomaly. Three Bondi Atlas was motionless. That's when panic turned to awe. Nothing, not comets, not asteroids, not even spacecraft, had ever done this before. The idea of an object pausing in space contradicted everything Newton and Einstein ever taught us. A hyperbolic orbit means escape. It means momentum that never stops. But the trajectory data showed something else entirely. A sudden plateau in speed, a silence in motion, as if some unseen force had pressed pause on the universe itself. NASA and ESA teams rushed to rule out natural explanations. Could the Sun's gravity have counteracted its velocity? Impossible. At that distance, solar pull was far too weak. Could it have been hit by another body? There was no debris, no shockwave, no shift in brightness. The phenomenon defied every model, a mystery wrapped in precision. For hours, the object remained fixed. Not drifting, not spinning off course, not accelerating, a frozen beacon in the dark. Even the background stars continued to move behind it, confirming it wasn't an illusion. It was the cosmos that moved, not 3i Atlas, and then, just as abruptly as it had stopped, it began to move again, slowly at first, as if regaining consciousness, then smoothly returning to its original path, leaving behind nothing but data and disbelief. That moment, the day motion itself faltered, would become one of the greatest puzzles in astronomical history. Scientists now refer to it as the pause, but as new analysis from the James Webb Telescope revealed, what happened that night wasn't just a glitch in celestial mechanics. The readings taken during those hours, the thermal pulses, the subtle oscillations in light, hinted at something even stranger. Because during the stillness, 3i Atlas wasn't silent. It was active. When the data from the first observatories came in, disbelief was the natural reaction. A pause in motion, impossible. 
Every scientist on duty assumed a malfunction, an error in calibration, a glitch in software, maybe a momentary disturbance caused by solar radiation. But that illusion shattered when one by one, observatories across the world confirmed the same impossible thing. From the Subaru telescope in Hawaii to La Silla in Chile, and even the European Southern Observatory in Paranal, astronomers began reporting identical readings. Fairty Atlas wasn't moving. The stars in the background shifted as expected. The galaxies drifted as they always did. But the interstellar object at the center of every frame remained locked in place, perfectly stationary. Within hours, the confirmation spread beyond professional networks. Amateur astronomers with high-precision instruments began capturing images that matched the professionals' data. Even small observatories in Spain, Japan and Australia verified the same coordinates. The object's relative position against the background sky was unchanged. It wasn't an error of optics nor of perception. It was real. The news raced across the international astronomy community. Data synchronization between multiple instruments, optical, infrared and radio, ruled out the possibility of a shared error. The phenomenon wasn't atmospheric. It wasn't software. The pause existed in space itself. The first official alert came from a collaboration between NASA's Minor Planet Center and the European Space Agency. Their joint message circulated among scientists in coded urgency, reading simply, Object 3i Atlas currently displays no measurable motion relative to background stars. Multiple confirmations received. Cause unknown. That phrase, cause unknown, sent ripples through every lab and control room. Researchers combed through every conceivable explanation. Could the telescopes have aligned perfectly with 3i Atlas's vector of motion, creating the illusion of stillness? Simulations quickly disproved that theory. The object's velocity and the Earth's orbit made such alignment impossible. The Hubble Space Telescope soon joined the effort. Despite its lower infrared sensitivity compared to the James Webb Telescope, Hubble's long-range optical imaging provided independent verification. The same stillness. The same position. Its sensors too detected no parallax shift, no measurable drift. The object wasn't merely slowing down, it was truly static. Meanwhile, James Webb, orbiting far beyond the moon, captured something deeper. Its infrared detectors recorded thermal variations, small but rhythmic, rippling across the object's surface. It was as though the body was alive with faint oscillations, breathing even as it remained motionless. By the time data from ground-based and orbital telescopes were cross-checked, one thing was undeniable, this wasn't a local anomaly. It was a cosmic event visible across the entire planet, confirmed through multiple independent optical systems. In science, replication is everything. And replication was exactly what made this moment terrifying. The same impossibility observed by one instrument could be dismissed as error. But when the entire network of human observation, spanning continents, time zones and technologies, saw the exact same thing, the truth became inescapable. Across every observatory, every telescope and every mind staring into the night, the realization sank in. The laws of motion had just broken right in front of us.